and today we're going where we're going to be making a headband and see i made this headband myself so now we're going to be making this headband so let's get started hi guys and today we'll be learning on how to make this pretty and casual headband it is the easiest on earth so let's get started first you will need to take any size of needle and any color of wool that you'd like so you will need to take a small amount of tail of the wool so now you will need to you you will need to make a slip knot over here like this this is how to make a slip knot as i teached you at last knitting video i made last time so you will need to put this and then pull it so now we will need to cast on four stitches One, two, three, four. Then you will need to take the other needle and do knit stitch. You can make any pattern you like. And see, knitting knitting a headband is actually very very nice. So yeah, you will need to do knit stitch. If it's too tight, you will just. you'll just do it as normally like how you do it normally all the time there's always a way to make it loose right so now you'll need to do here and knit your first row you need you need to knit all stitches like that's how i did from making the green headband so when you knit your first row you'll need to knit more you will need to knit more rows it's going to be very easy it's going to be very quick too if you knit this headband you need to measure it on your head and you need to knit the second row you need to knit like 100 rows for the headband that's that's pretty easy right guys <laughs> comment down below if it's very easy for you to make you can even tie it if you knit more than 100 rows you can even tie it and make it as a design So yeah, if it comment down below which color you'll use for your headband you're gonna make. So you will need to keep knitting all rows. So keep knitting until the size you want. So guys, we're done making it. This is eight, seven, seventeen and a half inches. So now we're going on bind off. can do a uh, measurements according to your head size but now we're going to bind off So we're done pulling it now you need to take the needle out and then take it from here and then it will become a loop like this okay guys then you will need to take this and then cut it like this now you will be left with the loop okay guys then you will need to do it like this Is after you sewed it, you need to do wave and I will show you after I'm done. So guys, I'm done making it. Look how pretty it looks. You can make it for your grandmother or daughter or mother. So comment down below how it looks and comment how yours came out. So bye.